The Ministry of Infrastructure, Transport, Port Services is continuing rehabilitation works on the island's road network and infrastructure. The Ministry Tuesday held a press briefing to discuss its improvement efforts. The Minister for Infrastructure, Port Services and Transport, Philip J. Pierre, called a press conference today to announce that the government was moving ahead with plans to rebuild the Bonte Bridge. This is part of a wider campaign to repair the island's road infrastructure damaged by Hurricane Tomas. Before the minister gave details, the permanent secretary gave a summary of works completed on major sites such as the Bardlil and other roads and bridges damaged by recent storms. I am pleased to announce that we have so far completed slides 4 and 5 at Bardlil, culverts or bridges at Opika, Monripo, Chumase, and Scarlet, together with a number of retaining walls at Debara, Ticolo, Twapiton, Vana, Cartier in Labri, Bacatel, Tiroche, Castries, Bocage, and many more. There is still much work to do as we strive towards rehabilitation of the infrastructure. Mrs. Jha said that there were many ongoing projects. The Minister for Infrastructure spoke about one of them, the Bonte Bridge, which was undermined by heavy rains earlier this year. Temporary repairs were effected, but a decision was taken to advance work on this critical bridge between the town of Grosselet and the Rodney Bay area. The minister provided details of the works to be undertaken. The Bonte Bridge and Bypass Road will cost $5.5 million dollars and it's located in one of the most important areas of St. Lucia. The project will see the construction of a new bridge 19.5 meters in width with the capacity for falling traffic in the future and also the construction of two pedestrian bridges. The minister sees the opportunity to outline the plans and budget for the ministry's projects, specifically taking time to assure the public of his commitment to transparency. It wasn't easy because we inherited an atmosphere, and I'm sure um, the staff may not want to say it, but we inherited an atmosphere of suspicion, an atmosphere of lack of trust, an atmosphere of lack of openness, all that will disappear when I happen to continue to be minister at the dictates of the Prime Minister. Work on the Bonte Bridge is expected to commence shortly, but this will be after the construction of a bypass road, including pedestrian crossings. For the CTV News, I am Jesse Leos.